Hello everyone, this time we're going to learn how to fix it if your iPhone is showing the error a problem was detected with a true depth camera, Face ID has been disabled. This issue can occur due to various reasons such as software glitches, hardware problems or misconfigurations in settings. Here are the effective solutions you can follow to troubleshoot and resolve the issue. Solution 1. Check for some quick settings. Open your phone's settings. Scroll down and then tap on Accessibility. Scroll down and tap on Face ID and Attention. And ensure that Require Attention for Face ID, Attention Aware Features and Haptics on Successful Authentication is enabled. If these three are already enabled, you can toggle these off. After that, re-toggle these options once again. If these options are not available here, then you can go run a hardware test for your Face ID. So, as for solution 2, check hardware test for Face ID related issues. Open the App Store. Now, go to the search bar and search for Check My Device. After finding it, simply find this app and install this app. After Check My Device has been installed, open the app. Now, after opening the app, scroll down and find the option called Face ID Test. Tap on it, then tap on it again to start the test. Then tap on Begin Test. Now your Face ID test will start and it will check if your Face ID sensor is working or not. If it's all working, then tap OK and tap on Pass. And it's all done. But if your Face ID is showing something different and it's showing the test has been failed, that means there's a hardware issue and you will need to take it to an Apple Support Center for help. Anything else will not work for you. But if your Face ID is showing fine, then you can try the other solutions. Solution 3. Reset Face ID. Open your phone settings, scroll down, and tap on Face ID and Passcode. You might be prompted to enter your passcode here, so simply enter your passcode. And then, scroll down again and tap on Reset Face ID. Tap on Reset, and after that, your Face ID should be reset, and you might be prompted to enter your passcode and everything, so do that. And after resetting your Face ID, see if your issue is fixed or not. Solution 4. Update and give a reset to all settings. Open your phone settings, scroll down and tap on general, tap on software update. If you find any available updates from here, simply update your device to the latest version and after updating, see if your issue is fixed or not. If your phone has all the latest updates available, you can try the other thing, like going back, scroll down to the bottom, tap on transfer or reset iPhone. Hit reset and then hit reset all settings. You might be prompted to enter your passcode once again, so enter your passcode and then confirm the reset. Be aware that this will reset all the settings on your phone, but it will not delete any of your data. So after resetting all your settings, I think your issue should be fixed for good, in case there is no hardware issue. But if you have hardware issue, then you will take, you need to take it to an Apple support center, otherwise it will not work. So guys, I hope this video helped you out in fixing your Face ID problem. And if it did, be sure to give this video a like and subscribe for more useful tips like this. See you next time.